Big Chat Boys, you Bob. Okay, we're doing? And we are back at y'all with another one. Oh, first question of today is. Yeah, man. Um, what sneaker has a mood to you? Something that you always want to get, but you need to find it or costly. Uh, the sneaker that eluded me, I'm gonna have to go with the Vashti Polo 2. Uh, when they came out, I wasn't, it was really like a super low Soho, and I, I wasn't in the notes, so I definitely did not obtain yeah. them. But as I heard about them, I was going out looked for them, and those are the ghosts of like the sneaker world. Like, you cannot find those things. Like, for me, it's not even about price, I just cannot find the sneaker of itself. Like, whether it's gold, StockX, eBay, Flight Club, there is nowhere I can find a pair in my size. So I can even say, is this price worth it? The Vashi Cola 2s are definitely a pair that have eluded me for about at least a good five, eight years of searching. Nice. Um, for me, it's my favorite color is green, and um, I like my son, Jesus. So, the Ray Allen. Shut up, Or yeah. just like, all right, cool, cool, cool. Both of them, honestly. <laughs> the one from Coney Allen. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? But, uh, the Ray Allen 13, the plus one. Ooh. Oh, you didn't want the ones that Jordan dropped? Nah, 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 nah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> the one that say, the one those ain't right, <laughs> right now. The ones that say right on the the top. But those those were good ones. Just like like the fashion, they were like uh, exclusive only to what was it, House of Hoops? Yeah. Yeah. So um, you know, not being in the know, and then years go by, and I'm I'm not gonna lie. Sneakers have sneakers for me. Like once they get to a certain, once they get to a certain point, I don't have the patience to save for it. So that's another way where it it eludes me. Let me y'all feel down below. What is the pair of sneakers that have eluded you? Let us know. Was it a price thing or was it just like the actual availability of the sneaker? I right, oh, it's feeling like the good old days again. Kanye is going at CEO. You ain't got the answers. Kanye. I, you, you ain't got you, the if, answers. If you, if, you ain't you, got if, the if, answers, Sway. You feel me? Resale is not really reselling. Yesterday's price is not today's price. Uh, and on Instagram the other day, someone asked me, how do I feel about the sneaker community right now? I'm going to let you start this one off. What, 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 do you, what, what, is, what is it giving? Oh, man. It's giving. I like it here. <laughs> and that's that's how I feel right now. Um, like you said earlier, when you intro the question. We sell on the fire red threes. The three is a great model. It's the fire red. Resale right now is practically retail, and it's oh, before the release. Hold on, hold on. Do you think I don't mean to cut your answer? But do you think that's like that because the Cardinal threes dropped last year and it's so similar? Yes, but the car the Cardinals aren't the fire reds. It's a it's an OG and it's doing like but I expect it to go up just like the fire red fours did. We expect it to go up too. Yeah, probably like four hundred at at max. Four hundred is max at for I, I see nothing above three fifty. The fire the fire red fours went up. Years. <laughs> it didn't take years. But like you said, resale is back down. I'm starting to see sneaker stores do first come first serve. Um, Action Boy is doing first come first serve on Fire Red Threes today. Um, yeah, I would, but they actually line up for those things, bro. Oh, they line two up. days in a row. They're um, camping out. Yeah, two days. Yo, in Kevin week. is back. Kevin is back. You suckers! I'm never camping for nothing. <laughs> Action Boy is also doing first come first serve on the J Balvin twos. I mean, a exclusive sneak like that, or signature sneak like that, they never really do first come first serve on. For it to be first come first serve, it's feeling like sneaker life is back. We back in 2012. Nah, it definitely give me 2012 uh, vibes. And unlike 2012, I got a job. Now. <laughs> so, uh, um, honestly, bro, this 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 was this was uh, a Sam Cook said. Sam Cook said. 
this was a long time coming. You feel me? Like the sneaker world went too crazy for too long. Like, and with that, these sneaker companies got comfortable in overdoing certain things. Like they overdid the collabs. They overdid like the exclusives. Like it just got so messy to where people that weren't really in the culture were fine with just walking away. And I am 100% fine with that because like you said, five red threes, bro, in about 20 minutes, I'm, I know I'm gonna hit on sneakers. You feel me? And I don't have like any inside plug. I just, it, there's just no super hype for it. Like I know I have like, it feels like I have a chance to participate in this once again without having to drop crazy prices. And even if I don't hit on sneakers, I'm gonna go to go and it's gonna probably be like twenty dollars over retail. I can live with that. You feel me? Like niggas just starting to feel real. real oh, only thing that has me a little shaky is to see how they do these lost and found ones. Like if they have pairs, bro, we're in the sneaker world is in good standing for at least the next two years. <laughs> but if they do any nonsense with these ones, bro, we're screwed, and it's it is over. Now nah, I'm joking. I don't, we're in good hands. All the Fairweather fans, all the people that was here because of crazy resale prices, they're quickly exiting. So it's about to go back to a actual sneaker lover community. And I'm so excited for that. Also, like, those Tom Sacks that's about to drop, though, if we had dropped those two years ago, like right now, they're going for like pretty much retail. If we had dropped those two years ago, those would have been a $2,000 shoot just because of what the Mars Dogs yeah. did. So I'm so happy to see like, yo, it's not about a crazy resale price right now. It's about like, yo, good product. And I feel like a lot of good product is gonna come from this time because they have to build back up that anticipation, that hype where they were riding off for the last three or four years. But we can leave here without talking about your boy, Ye. How you feel about Ye versus Adidas? This shit, it's a human world tour, man. It's Yay versus everybody. Uh, but Yay versus Adidas. I think I said this last night. Let's, let's go on. Yay wants to do himself, but he also still wants the backing. So he gonna make he gonna make up with Balenciaga. Yeah, he gonna make up with. But he's beefing with Balenciaga too. He went. He went. He went. He went, he went, he went, he went, he went everybody, bro. <laughs> I have to forget this question. I only gave on that cake jack. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, go ahead. No, nah, I, I just think that um, he's right. He's right in to create something that is identical to his design and his idea. That's good for your own. Isn't cool. But at the same time, like they gave him the platform to create his uh, his ideas and push that to the world. So they gotta find a move around. They they will or something. Honestly bro, I don't think they gotta find a middle ground bro. Like Adidas pushing together with those uh what is the foam cube things? Like they're dropping mad colorways and those things are wild ugly and it's also wild disrespectful. Like it is. I I don't think there's no making that up. Uh but who who gonna get that kind of nobody. So they got they got they got to They don't out. have to, bro. Like they could just go back to being Adidas. Who wants to go back to being Adidas? Adidas. No, they don't. No. Those things don't sell without Kanye. What things don't sell? Those nasty things that they made. With the the the, the, the foam cube thing. Yeah, they don't sell. Nah, those things should not sell. Period. I don't care who's behind it. What those they things. They but like, oh, let's, let's let's also be for real. To a certain section, Adidas is a Kanye thing, but Adidas was a successful brand prior to Kanye. Sure. And if I'm Adidas, I don't feel like I need you. Like, if it was nice, what, hey, 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 what, if I'm Adidas, here's how I look at Kanye. What Kanye? I look at Kanye like KD on the Warriors. Having you here definitely made winning way easier. I don't need you to win. You don't need me to stay afloat. You need me to win. That's not true. The yeah. Warriors won after KD. The Warriors won pr prior to KD. They won after KD. They did. Adidas have won prior to Kanye. And if Kanye leaves, Adidas is going to 
It may not be immediate like it was before, but it is to get back to winning. No. Why? Oh, Who stop. 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 All right, stop. They don't need Wait. anybody. Who they have when it was winning before Kanye? What? Who did they have when they were winning before Kanye? They needed Pharrell to win before. They were winning before Pharrell. Like, oh, no, are you serious? What? Name name a model before the NMD, the human race NMDs that was selling, that was moving. Go. They sell. No, they sell. Thousands of pairs of Stan Smiths every year. What are we talking about? The superstars move. Like, they don't need a hot model. They, they sell sneakers every year. They oh. do, though. They no sell sense, sneakers. No Every and those day. same models are in the outlet for thirty dollars. Those same sneakers, those same sneakers that you say they sell thousand, the same sneakers that you say they sell. Oh. What kind you say? You going to lose billions, billions, not millions, billions if you let me walk, bro. <laughs> like if I leave, you're going to. If you lose, Kanye said that. Why would he say that? Like, what, Kanye, stop, like, where did we fact check that? What? Where did we fact check that? Where's Kanye getting his billions from? He got it's mainly his fashion, yes. It's mainly his. So they're going to. So, so stop. They're going, Adidas, they, didn't, Adidas didn't have billions before Kanye. Yes, but that doesn't mean that they're not they're not going to lose billions when they lose Kanye. Bro. And that's why I said he's like KD. So, yes, when KD first left, the Warriors had a slump. That doesn't mean they don't get back, bro. They'll get back to what they have what they have with Kanye? No, they don't. They don't. Who are, who's going to bring them there? If you're no, staying, they if you're are staying Adidas. Afloat, they do not see Kanye. If you're staying afloat, right? I'm a we we make let's say five billion a year, right? And with Kanye, we make eight billion a year. You're never getting back to that eight billion. Who's gonna bring you back to that eight billion? You can still be a billionaire, but you're not. You 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 lost that money. You're not recouping that money. Dog. All right. First of all, I think you gave uh, Kanye's. Uh, impact to Adidas selling power a little too much. Like I, I don't. If what do you? Oh, let, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. If Adidas was making five and then it jumped to eight, you cannot tell me Yeezy was a three billion boost. But okay, whether it was or wasn't, I personally don't think he had that much of an impact. Made up, how much you made up the Yeezys? How much does the Yeezy brand bring no, in? I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. You tell he's me. A, he's a non billionaire. <laughs> you tell me how much, how much does his Yeezy brand work? He said about 3.9. He said about 3.9. 3.9 billion. Okay. He got from just Yeezy. All right. Congratulations to Kanye. So that means that it factors into Adidas too. That 3.9 billion that he got from, if he's not, especially if they're, they're partners and he's getting half of, half of what, he's not getting the full thing. That means that Adidas is probably getting that same right, so hold on. You, you yeah. believe that Kanye is attributing more to, like, let's say, I, I don't know, a uh, 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 hundred percent pop. Mm -hmm. How much do you think Adidas is depending on Yeezy? About thirty percent. Thirty. I could live without that. You could live. You could, I could live without that. You live Dog, you're dragging me in in, in, the, in the media. You're putting out pictures out there. I could live without your thirty percent. We'll be fine. You, we'll be fine. You'll, you'll still be a millionaire, but you'll, we'll, we'll be you'll fine. have way less money. And, and like, like Draymond said, we was winning without you, we're going to win with all. Um, we was winning before you, we're going to win after you. If I'm a Adidas, you're I am fine. That's but I'm also going to back Kanye. I don't like something like that form. Q Adidas is doing it was corny. That's wrong. I'm not even going to front my girl. I think it's in the right with this. The easy day thing, uh, I kind of had Adidas back. But... I heard there's a lot going on with Kanye and Adidas behind the scenes, which made that Easy Day debacle what it was. So I'm not saying what they're doing to you in the least bit is right. But I'm trying to say this. I'm Adidas. I'm paying, I, I, I like, Yay said they offered him like 1.7 bill. I would, I would give him the three to leave. Like, you're not going to drag me in the mud. Like, if I'm Adidas, I don't need you. It was nice to have you here. I don't need you. No, what what I, what Adidas is doing is wrong, from what I've heard. But if I'm Adidas, I don't need you here. It's nice to have you. I don't need you. For sure, you don't you don't need anybody in your life. Stop. But <laughs> besides, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. but besides that, now you actually need Jesus in your life, man. You need Jesus. But if I'm Adidas, I don't feel like I need it. How many of you see Stan Smith? 
A lot. Yo, oh. How many you you said the same see? thing about I mean, blue guys. A, a lot, bro. A lot of people wearing Stan Smith. How many people you see wearing 350? A lot. Now, compared to the people that you see wearing Stan Smith and the people right, that you see wearing Yeezys, when, when what Yeezy, do you see when more? Yeezy and you see uh, more? I see more Stan Smith, to be honest with you. But when Yeezy and the I'm serious. Okay. Okay. And when Yeezy you, and the I'm on the train. Oh, I, I don't know. What do, you, what do you want me to do? I'm just like, what what areas do you travel when you see more Stan Smith? Than I go from Brooklyn to Harlem. Okay. So anyway, so I'm gonna take the train from Brooklyn to Harlem. Huh? I'm gonna take the train from Brooklyn to Harlem. Please do. It's a, it's a lovely ride. Okay. Uh, besides, besides, I got a crackhead here. It is. Hey, come on, you know, love the Lux Valley. You told me the A train fast way to Harlem, man. But um, when they do split, who do you think is impacted more? Because like, I think going to be impacted more. Fine, so my easy. If, I, if I'm a Adidas, I'm fine with that. You fine with it being impacted? Yes. That's cool. Listen, we're gonna take a hit. I, you know, maybe, maybe I, I can't own 15 homes in Malibu. Maybe just ten. I'll take that hit. But 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 here's my thing. I can't live on fifteen. But here's my thing. If you, if where you, where where you go now? If you had fifteen pair of sneakers and you lost five of them, you're gonna be tired at the fact yeah, that you oh, lost five pairs of sneakers. Oh, I sold seven pairs of sneakers to get these. I am fine with losing something, but you to get something that I want. You have to. If I'm a leader right now, I'm a piece of mind. You have to sell. You gonna stop violating me in the public? My kids, my kids have to have Instagram. You gotta, you gotta sell your best five pairs. You gotta sell your best seven pairs. Like you're losing your best seven pairs. It's not like, it's not like, oh, these are pairs that I don't wear often. These are pairs that I wear very, very often. Like you gotta sell your board doors. You gotta sell. What is another, what's another favorite of yours? You gotta sell your favorite sneakers in order to get your peace of mind. If it's a matching colors, I'm gonna have to do it. Is it more sneaker D? You gotta sell. Uh, let's know how y'all feel about these, uh, the sneaker community and the topics we just touched on below. Until next week. Peace, peace. out.